Well, former Auburn tight end Philip Lutzenkirchen only spent a spring and a summer as an assistant coach at St. James High School in Montgomery until he was killed in a car crash on June 29th. Philip is no longer on the sidelines physically, but he made his mark in the spirit of one high school senior who is now determined to carry out his legacy. When Jalen Harris steps onto the plains, he'll be part of the Auburn family, he'll high five fans at Tiger Walk, and he'll score touchdowns against some of the best teams in the country. But he has something bigger in mind. I think about him all the time. I have a, a picture of me and him on my nightstand. I see every morning when I wake up. Philip Lutzenkirchen was Jalen's tight ends coach at St. James. Though he had no bearing on Jalen's commitment to Auburn. University of Auburn. Philip was so proud when he made that decision. He was like the, the second person to come walk in the door. So that was that was really uh, cool to me because he was one of the first people there, front and center. He was just uh, he was just for me, 100 percent. That was on Tuesday. The following Sunday, Jalen woke up to several text messages and tweets. I cried for about a week straight. I, I didn't know I, I didn't know you know I, it felt like a movie. Um, I just, I didn't know what to think. It was, it was unreal for me to be at such a high at one point a couple days ago and then out of nowhere just to get this devastating news. It was, it seemed, it was just so unreal to me. Seven months have passed since that Sunday morning and Jalen has made it his mission to do what it says on the bracelet he wears every day, live like Lutz. At some point it's going to end for me and, and uh, I'd, I'd much rather be known for what I've done off the field and impacting other people's lives and what, how many touchdowns or how many catches I've had. I believe that, uh, you know, carrying his legacy, that's, 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 that's one thing we all should do because he was a great man and I just hope that one day I can be half of what he was and, and do half of the things he did. I sense that there's a lot of Jalen that has that quality to him and so it's, it's a pretty simple thing but it's, it's pretty powerful. like a little piece of Phillips out there playing football. Jalen hopes that he'll get to wear number 43 at Auburn. In the studio, Melissa Kim, WIAT 42 Sports, coverage you can count on.